Hi, welcome to my channel. At kung bago ka lang dito, ay huwag kalimutang mag-subscribe at pindutin lang ang notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa aking mga bagong math tutorial videos. Today class, ang ipoprove naman natin ay ang theorem number 6 or the mid-segment theorem of trapezoid. Theorem number 6. The median of a trapezoid is parallel to its base and its length is one half the sum of the length of the vases. Given trapezoid MINS with the median line segment PR. Prove that line segment PR is parallel to line segment IN and line segment PR is parallel to line segment MS. And line segment PR is equal to the one half of the sum of line segment MS and line segment IN. So, sa number one class, kokopihay lang natin yung given trapezoid MINS with median line segment PR. Sa number two naman, ang nakalagay sa ating statement, draw IS with P. So, ito class yung uh, line segment IS and then P as its midpoint. So, ang pwede natin class ilagay dito sa reason ay yung line postulate. So, ano ba class yung line postulate? Sa line postulate, through any two points, there is exactly one line. Next, number three, line segment PP is equal to one half of line segment MS. And line segment TP is parallel to line segment MS. At kung mapapansin natin class na itong line segment TP natin ay mid-segment ng nabuong triangle MIS. So basically class, papasok ito sa theorem number 5 or midline theorem of triangle. Next, number 4. So, sa number 4 class, meron na tayo nakalagay sa statement. Meron na rin tayo nakalagay sa ating reason. So, line segment PR is equal to 1 half of line segment IN. And line segment PR is parallel to line segment IN. So, yung naging reason naman natin dito is theorem number 5 or midline theorem. So, mapapansin natin class na halos parehas lang yung ating number 3 at number 4. So, sa number 3 class, yung mid-segment natin is uh, line segment TP doon sa triangle MIS. Dito naman class, sa number 4, yung line segment PR naman yung ating naging uh, mid-segment doon naman sa triangle INS. Next, number 5, uh, line segment MS is parallel to line segment IN. So, ito class yung ating line segment MS at ito yung ating line segment IN. So, parallel po daw. So, pwede natin class ilagay dito sa reason yung definition ng trapezoid. So, definition ng trapezoid. Trapezoid is a quadrilateral with exactly one pair of opposite sides are congruent. At para naman class sa number 6, line segment TP is parallel to line segment IN. So, pakita natin class yung ating line segment TP at ito naman yung ating line segment IN. So, ang gagamitin natin class sa reason, definition ulit, but this time, definition of parallel. So, lines on a plane that never met and they are always same distance apart. Next, number 7. So, TP and PR are both parallel to TP, parallel to IN, thus T, P, and R are collinear. So, TP and PR class are either parallel or the same line. Or, pwede pa rin natin dito ang gamitin class yung definition of parallel. Next, number 8. So, sa so number 8, Line segment TR is equal to the sum of line segment TP and line segment PR. So, katulad lang class nung ginawa natin sa midline theorem. SAP or segment addition 
property. Next, number 9. So, sa number 9, nakalagay class sa reason ay substitution. So, hanap lang tayo class ng pwede nating gamitan ng substitution tulad class ng uh, line segment TR is equal to 1 half of line segment MS plus 1 half of line segment IN. And for number 10, line segment TR is equal to 1 half of the sum of line segment MS and line segment IN. So, katulad lang ito class nung statement na inilagay natin sa number 9. Dito nga lang, kailangan muna natin gamitan ng distributive property of equality. At yun yung ilalagay natin class sa reason. Distributive property of equality. So, hanggang dito na lang class. Kung meron po kayong hindi naintindihan at meron po kayong gustong itanong, ilagay lang sa ating comment section at isa-isa po natin niyang sasagutin. Muli, maraming salamat sa panonood. God bless.